When it comes to hot beverages, there's definitely two things. There's tea and coffee. What do you guys prefer? I got into coffee because I started binging Peter McKinnon. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Glad to see you here. So my journey as a graphics designer has really been a great one, but one of the greatest things uh, one of the lessons I've had to learn and I've really enjoyed is discovering sites that can really help you. You know as a designer you're always creating and when you find a site that can help you enhance your designs or give you ideas, it's something that you hold and cherish. So there are a few sites I wanted to share with you guys today that I use personally uh, that enable me to create my graphics, that enable me to do my personal branding or any kind of branding. And I think if I give them to you, they can also help you. And some of them are also able to help you even if you don't have the big programs you use like Illustrator, Premiere Pro or any other. You could basically and easily do them on your phone. So that's what I wanted us to share today. So we're going to jump into the laptop real quick. So the first site we're going to be looking at is called Freepik. Freepik essentially is a site where you can find vectors, nice PSDs and very high quality images, all free stock images. And they have a premium account, but the free account also gives you great things. And for those of you who are not graphics designers, a vector is just an image or an object that you can expand or blow up to a very big size and will always maintain its quality no matter how big it gets. So that's what a vector is. Um, this site requires a bit of skill in Adobe um, suit in terms of Illustrator and Photoshop so that you're able to extract files and use them in those programs but otherwise it's a great site for graphics design and you can get a lot of things from here for example if we wanted to design a coffee logo we could really search that out get really nice images of coffee um, logos or ideas and extract them from there and then also move on to uh, make our own logo so that's what Freepik is all about the second site now is what they call Flat Icon. Flat Icon is a very good site for any icons you need, no matter what, be it an animal, be it a symbol, uh, be it even a logo design you want to create. You could get very nice icons from here. And the same as we've seen in Freepik, these are vectors, meaning if you blow them up, they'll still maintain a good quality. But this is Flat Icon. It's a very good site for anyone who needs symbols and easily usable for anybody. You don't need any skill. You can easily download this, use it on your phone. Um, on your apps that you use for editing in your phone. If you actually want to know any software for editing on phone, please let me know in the comments below. Probably we could do a video about that. But this is flat icon. Any icons you need, you will find them here. Thirdly, we have Unsplash. Unsplash is a very good site for great images. This is one I found later in, uh, can I say, my career as a graphics designer. And it's a very good one for companies or people whose brand strategy is mostly towards imagery if your images speak the most in your graphics design or in your branding and splash is a great place and you'll definitely find what you need and then number four and finally the last one is pexels i saved the best for last why i say it's the best it also has free video footage that you can use and put onto your videos that will make it great like the intro you saw for this video that first shot there that is from pixels.com and that's very good i don't know how you pronounce it pixels pixels i don't know what i love about it as well is that they've also introduced more photos that are of black people so it's not so much only of white people which has really been a problem with stock size for a really long time but now they have so much um, value and um, so many images of black americans of africans that you can really use to make your images stand out and really be proud of them so there you have it those are the four editor mark here i almost forgot one great one and i think it would be best for me to show it to you on my phone why it's called canva canva has an app where you can get any edits you want you could find um social media flyers you could find invites if you're making invites you can find wide variety of things that you need to design your graphics and you can do it all on your phone and it's easy to use you just tap whatever you want probably this is what you want and then it will allow you to edit it in the phone and this is very great for anybody who's not really accustomed to illustrator or to photoshop or to any adobe suit or any other suit that graphics designers use so this is a very great one for you who says how can i edit on my phone so um 
back to the video hope it has helped you a lot um there are great sites that have helped me every day of my life i use any four of these I always have what i need i've never looked away from any of these and i hope you will find them useful otherwise that's it from me today hope you like this video like it down there um subscribe to the channel if you aren't already it means a lot and hit the notification bell so that you get notified every time we post a video i love you bye bye